Hey, good morning, traders. Uh, I want to do just a quick global macro rundown. Um, I will say, you know, we're about to have our live room session, <clears throat> but I put in the real time alerts that I like being short here. Um, we're back to the pie area on the 15 minute. When you look at the 30 minute here on the euro, we were oversold, right? So we bounce back towards the 200. You have pie above the market. So I'm leaning day trade short euro. And then um, I still came in long from Friday. We talked about getting above the bands that you could rally. It's exactly what's happened. Um, so I'm still looking for some follow through here. Still looking for some follow through here on Euro Kiwi. All right, we can go back to Pi very easily. But what I want to see is a 15 minute cycle come back up here. And right now the 15 minute cycle is down. So I'm waiting on that to get long again. And then let's just go over some other markets here. I covered some tens this morning. Not a lot of movement, but relative to where we were here, I covered a few tens and running a core short. I mean, we're not exactly oversold in treasuries, but at the same time, I covered one fifth of what I'm short. That way, if we bounce 10 ticks or so over the intermediate term, I'll reshort. I'll reshort those tens. If we fail down into pi here, down around 125 and three quarters, you know, I'll cover some more tens and I'll probably buy some fives also. If you look at fives right next to each, right next to them, the tens. Um, well, let's see. Maybe you can see over here where we're where we're buying fives. Yeah, that's better. So we bought some fives late last week. Running a core long again. And I'll I'll buy some more fives if we get back towards 118, most likely. So I like playing short tens, long five year notes. Um, did rebuy some NASDAQ this morning. So this was our last sell signal up here. Pretty much was the high got all right so got took off all my futures and then i rolled into some calls up here just small to keep the core long but now this is where i want to start rebuying so i'm going to buy a little bit on this dip and then the next dip i'm going to buy even more the nasdaq all right um So, still think that's one of the best places to be. Long tech, growth continues to accelerate. Inflation's rolled over since the first quarter. Let's look at oil. Oil I talked about last night, guys, still long-term bearish. I'm still a bear overall. But this daily cycle is pretty low. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see our signals on this or not. Okay, there we go. So we were short up here, covering, 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 got flat with the bottom of the cycle. I don't know, man. we're right here at the eight. Not a bad place to maybe sell a little bit. But if we do get above the eight, then we got to think about a rally back towards the 30, 48 area, maybe even all the way back to the top of the bands, depending on if the cycle cycles back up. Let's look at the four hour. Four hour cycles high. Back at the 30 on the four hour. I think I will short a few. I'll get a little bit short here oil this morning. 46 and a half area. Probably sell the E minis and then if we do pop towards 48, I'll get I'll get bigger on the actual contracts. Trains. 
going by, sitting outside. Um, gold, I don't see a whole lot to do in gold. I think I'm going to wait for the next dip to buy, maybe closer to 1250. And you have a double top at 1300. If you sold it, I would be covering that because this is still actually in an uptrend. <clears throat> but this this is the area I'm kind of eyeing to go long. It's half. It's a 50% retrace of this move, or it's halfway back the wall as we call it. So 1250 area is kind of where I'm thinking on gold. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. Here this morning. So playing some Euro shorts, still core short the Euro, long the NASDAQ, covered some tens, um, not doing much in gold, and then reshorted a little bit of oil. So I'll keep you guys updated. Hope that helps. And uh, um, yeah, look forward to talking to more of you in the chat. So hopefully we'll do this every, start to do more videos like this for those on the uh, in the chat room. And we'll get get some more of you involved. All right, guys. We'll talk to you.